obedience. That is so important. I pray that the Lord brings us all to that place of hearing his voice and immediately obeying. No questions asked. Then you'll see what happens. And in the process, you will be growing in relationship with God. And you will learn how to serve. A lot of Christians who want to do ministry, they think they know everything about ministry already. Or they think, oh, I'm ready. I'm so ready to go do, you know, go serve people. But it all, it just ends up being a performance. And it's very self-centered, unfortunately. And they think that all of that is somehow placing God. They see that as them... Uh, pursuing God himself, but it's really not. What thoughts cross your mind when you think about serving people and about yourself? Really evaluate yourself. I encourage you to spend some of the time to intentionally seek God and ask him, Lord, have I been thinking wrong about a lot of things? Show me God. And he brings things that are in secret to light. We need to bring certain things to the surface and it's going to be painful at first. It can, it's going to be annoying. It's going to be, I don't want to deal with this right now because it doesn't make your flesh feel any good. Well, those are the exact things that must come to the surface and we need to deal with them. So don't be so concerned about ministry, ministry, ministry. Go after relationship with God and you growing as a person. What better way to do that than partnering with the Holy Spirit? This whole process will be so much more fulfilling for you. The end result will be beautiful. It will be authentic Christianity if you partner with the Holy Spirit on this and not try to do things on your own and only try to, you know, let God come in uh, into the picture when you feel necessary. When I said authentic Christianity, it made me kind of uncomfortable because a lot of people keep throwing that term around very loosely. If you're not yielded to the Holy Spirit and giving him lordship over your life, the Christianity that you think you are living or pursuing is not authentic we must host him his presence that's what it's all about my brother and sister ask yourself why do i even want to do this why why ministry why am i so obsessed with this idea of like doing ministry or appearing a certain way in front of people is that what it's about what is it really about preparation time is never wasted time my brother and sister you will see when the time comes how you're able to just step in and you'll have everything you need not just knowledge but resources and the ideas and the way to do things and the way to speak to people and all of that you'll realize that my goodness the lord has prepared me with all of this all the necessary things wow god is good